We'd like to thank our proud sponsor for this first contest, Bourbon Manson. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. or not, only associates himself with the absolute best here at Wildcat Sports, and you cannot deny that Ryan Davidson, a former Wildcat heavyweight champion, is absolutely that. Look at this size difference between grizzled Ryan Davidson and Jace Valor, and a nice show of respect to kick things off here at Wildcat Sports presents The Wrestler Who Slammed Me. We'll see if that respect continues, you know, once he starts throwing hands here, Sammy, I might break down. Wildcat official Joe Little making sure we have a nice, clean fight to kick things off on a huge night. Of course, Brady Pierce defending the heavyweight title later on tonight against PJ Hawks in our main event. And there's one of these two going to be in line to challenge whoever comes out of that contest. PJ Hawks looking for his first singles title here in Wildcat Sports, former tag team champion. Of course, we've got two former champions in the run right here. Ryan Davis, as we mentioned, a former Wildcat heavyweight champion. Jace Fowler, a former Revolution champion in his own right. You know, Jake, we got the Wildcat Sports Revolution Rumble coming up soon. Can you see uh, one of these two men entering and going on to win the Revolution Rumble? Well, Sammy, that is an absolute possibility. You know, Revolution Rumble is where dreams come true. That's where you get in there and by no other means, if you win, that's automatically a title shot. And that's something special. These two know all about him. I and mean, Ryan Davidson came down to the final two in 2019, the biggest Revolution Rumble ever. And of course, Jace Valor, a former Revolution Rumble winner in his own right. But Jace Valor is, uh, as you see him, getting slammed right there to the center of the ring. Ryan Davidson showing that he has the power advantage here. Jace Valor has not been on much of a winning streak as of late, Dave. No, he hasn't. You know, a win here against Ryan Davidson can really mean a lot more than just a win here. You know, uh, a win could push Jace to get some forward momentum. Maybe get back on a winning track. He's so trying to jockey in position. Jace Fowler has all the technique in the world and has all the credentials, all the tools to be the top star here at Wildcat Sports and really needs to get that, that just that extra edge here, get some momentum behind him, and it's not going to happen right there. It goes a big shoulder block, and the big Texas Bear, Ryan Davidson, doesn't even budge. And oh, there goes Jace Fowler up on the shoulders of Ryan Davidson. Now the waist lock, standing switch here. And there's a big sharp elbow, but Ryan Davidson now finally letting go. 
James Valor is going to have to find a way to use his agility, use his quickness here, because the power is not going to be anything that he's going to do. Close line and the shoulder block takes Jace Valor straight down. As I'm saying, Jace Valor, as far as power match, is not going to be able to match Davis. He's got to use his quickness, he's got to use his agility, he's got to find a way to win. There's a big chop to the chest from Ryan Davidson. I'm not that sure that's the way you get there. Jace Bauer eating a turnbuckle, now eating a fist from Ryan Davis. I appreciate that Ryan Davis is not taking Jace Valor lightly here. One of the absolute best in the history of Wildcat sports. Ryan Davis held the Wildcat heavyweight title for a record 914 days. Quick Which, man, that's, that's almost three years. Not trying to uh, show why here, but Jace Valor trying to take every open he can against the big man. Big drop kick sends Ryan Davis flying into the corner, and as does Jace Valor. Looks like Jace Bauer's finding a little something here. Found something in the tank. Ooh, and a big chop from Jace Bauer. Ooh, I think that just made Ryan Davidson angry. You know, there's an old expression, Davis, that you don't want to poke the bear, and Jace Bauer might be doing just that. But that's the aggression that Jace Bauer's going to have to show if he's going to get an edge, not just here against Ryan Davidson, but to get some momentum here. Wildcat Sports! And uh, Ryan Davis is going to show Jace Fowler there that that's going to be easier said than done. Yeah, I, you know, I'm, I'm questioning Jace Fowler as I could here. I mean, it, he did come from the trailer park, didn't he? Jace Fowler, a proud representative of Baton Rouge, is not someone that came from a privileged upbringing, but never let him stop him from trying to achieve his dreams. And if he has a caved-in chest, I don't know how many dreams he's going to be accomplishing, though, Dave. He can really use those cousins or brothers of his right now. What happened to those guys? And Jace Fowler got a not too auspicious start here at Wildcat Sports. Of course, a member of the mobile home mob, Dave. Ouch. But he really uh, rose above that, that almost comical setting that to go on to win the Revolution Rumble, to go on to become a Revolution champion in his own right. Oh, my goodness. Jace Bowers is in real trouble here. That's about the, probably the smartest thing he has done this entire match was collapsing down to his butt. Oh! And then sending the bear face first into the top turnbuckle. Grizzle Ryan Davidson is loopy. Oh, big chop Ooh, block. All right. I think Jace Valor may have found his opening. And you saw that quick technique. Jace Valor colliding into the knee. And here's the cover. Hooks the far leg. And Got a one count only. Jace Fowler, you saw that he clipped that knee and then immediately had to move his body over. He would have been crushed under the weight of Ryan Davidson. That's the ring awareness that Jace Fowler brings. You can tell that he definitely scouted and came in with a game plan for Ryan Davidson. You know, I, I'm liking this more aggressive side of Jace Fowler. Maybe that's, maybe that's what Jace Fowler needs to turn this thing around. Maybe, he need, maybe he's been Mr. Nice Guy too long. A big scoop slam. From Ryan Davidson, now they can tell her for that million dollar fist drop. And oh, Chase Fowler moves out of the way. Davidson may have broken knuckle on that one. Free state and Enziguri collides right into the face and going right into the cover here. Two count only. You know, Chase Fowler looking a little bit better than I expected him to against Ryan Davidson. Chase Fowler has got something to prove. He's had classic matches this year going up one-on-one -on -one with P.J. Hawks, going against Nate Bradley, matches that earned him a standing ovation. But I caught up with Dave before tonight's matchup, Dave. Jace Fowler doesn't care about ovation. He doesn't care about winning match of the night in terms of the fans' enjoyment. He wants to get the win. That's the only way you get shots at championships. That's the only way you get put into main events. And I think Jace Fowler is starting to realize that there's more to becoming a professional wrestler than getting the, the crowd come behind you. And is that going to affect his game plan here tonight, Dave? Absolutely, Sammy. I cannot say that I don't agree with you 100%. Jace Bauer is finding a little bit more about who he is and what it takes for him to be a top guy. Big power slam takes Jace Bauer down. And Ryan Davidson showing why he's one of the absolute best in professional wrestling, taking quite a beating from the bullet. Still in this fight, though, pulling that power slam from almost out of nowhere. Yeah, you can never count either one of these guys out. Ryan Davidson, champion, multiple promotions around the country, around the world. Jace Valor, constant underdog, never say die. Well, there's one of those decorated champions, but never say die about Jace Valor. Stiff whites to the jaw, Jace Valor. Juking and jiving goes the Texas Bear. Little flip flop and fly. Straight punch right to the jaw of Jace Valor here. Atomic oh, drop. Goodness, Jace Valor's in trouble here. 
Ryan Davis is feeling that momentum. First time wasn't the charm. Will this one connect? Ooh. Million dollar fist drop right to the face of the bullet. Guess this time, could that be all? Ryan Davis looks like he might be looking for some insurance. Not going immediately for the pin here. Might be a mistake, but I don't know. Let's see what he's got in mind. And we talk about Jace Fowler, the crowd behind him. I think that this crowd is firmly behind Ryan Davis, and is that playing into the mind of Jace Fowler, David? You know, Jace Fowler looks like he's not. Maybe, maybe that is getting Jace Fowler worked up. Oh my God! Power bomb yeah, yes. connects. Is that enough? And no, Jace Fowler gets a shoulder up. Joe Wells confirming that was only a two count. Referee arguing I, with Harper. Buddy Harper saying it was a three. I can't believe it. Harper can't believe it. That looked like three to me. I'm not sure how Jace Dar kicked out of that power bomb. Now Ryan Davis is signaling he's going to take things up a notch. Are we going to go to that big bear lariat? You can't strike a man if he collapses to the ground. Jace Fowler might not have enough to even continue this fight, David. I'm not sure what's going on here. Jace Bauer might not have any gas left in the tank. Referee right there to check on Jace Bauer, see if he can continue. Oh, what oh, Jace, I think, was playing possum, David. And back to that left knee of Davidson. He he right to the face. Oh, goodness. Sick kick. Hey, the bigger they are, the harder they fall. Is that enough to keep the bear down? No, Ryan Davis gets the shoulder up. That was close. That was close. Jace Bauer can taste that victory. If he can stay on Davidson, he might be able to pull this off. Look, he's getting frustrated though. Don't want to let that set in. Takes Valor now stalking the wounded Davidson, looking for that cutter. Oh, Davidson able to hold on to the ropes and avoid what could have been a disaster. A big elbow to Jace Valor. Oh, look at that! Goodness gracious! Kick connects right to the face and into that bad knee of Ryan Davidson. Davidson may have lost a tooth on that one. Chase Fowler cutting down the big tree. They're trying to go in there, but referee checking with Ryan Davidson, arguing with Chase Fowler. No, Chase putting his hands on the referee. I don't know if you can man. do that. I don't know if you can do that, Sammy. Go for the kill shot. The crowd didn't like Ryan it. Ryan Davidson oh, with goodness. the bear lariat. My God. Took his head clean off on that one. And there's the Davidson driver. Goodness, that's got to be it. Cover here. And that's it. Valiant effort from Jace Bauer. Maybe if he had a few more brain cells, he would have been able to pull this off. But there you have it. Ryan Davison, victorious. Another somebody in the house of Harper. A great victory for Ryan Davison. Continues to show why he's one of the best in this business. Impressive victory. Heartbreaking loss for the bullet, Jace Bauer. Jace Fowler had this match well in hand, except for some unfortunate timing. The referee down there checking if Brian Davis could, could continue. Jace Fowler not able to capitalize on that momentum. And is that why Brian Davis got his hand raised here tonight, David? Yeah, I mean, I'm not really sure what happened there. Uh, Jace Fowler looked like he was in trouble a couple times there. I didn't see the referee checking on him getting Ryan Davis's way. But as soon as Ryan Davis was down, it's almost like it's almost like this ref is in the pocket of the House of Harp. I don't know. Jace Fowler is lucky that he uh, didn't win, didn't lose by disqualification. You see Ryan Davis trying to show a sign of respect. Jace Fowler wants to have none of it. Jace Fowler, I think, is getting pretty frustrated that his luck has not turned. What does Jace Fowler got to do to catch a break here at Wildcat Sports? I mean, I don't know, but I can feel his frustration. A handshake, some kind of consolation prize. What is that? Well, the bullet came back in the ring here. Maybe he thought it over. And that's the that's the Jace Fowler that I know, David. Jace Fowler, a man of respect. You can understand, you know, how frustrated Jace Fowler must be. The cooler heads prevailed. A nice show of respect from Jace Fowler, and a huge win for Grizzled Ryan Davidson.